I have done a lot of grinding. I am now level 23, with a level 29 at my heart. My Kezu gear is tier 3. And I have unlocked every ice trap from every creature that I could. I have none to cross. I think I'm ready to take on the Tigra. it was by the wolf bats, wasn't it? Should be around here somewhere. And let's see if first good enough. Bitey buddy. My sword does 45 with a chance of paralysis. My armor is high, my health is high, and my teammates are strong. It's not going the way it did last time. Oh. I even have a strategy now. He has a double speed move. But I now have a Nursilla that can block. Speed abilities. I need to sleep him once he gets to the vicious part. Bonus. Come here, my little friend. second air. Fang beast. It could be. It could be a fang beast. The phone with the uh, egg list is dead at the moment, so I'm just going to hope. I will hope. Goody, goody. Good
Oh yeah, I also went back and killed a Kezu. And tamed a Kezu. So that mission's finished. You can only find the normal Kezu in the tunnel. The red Kezus can spawn pretty much anywhere. Metal blade. Water blade. Oh yeah. If you accept the World Drop mission and the Nursilla mission, you miss the farm money. things that are in the pizza shop. have its bits now though. That's something. Let's head off. I'll come back and grind here again once I need more money. Or have the uh, materials to upgrade. What I meant to do. God bug. Okay, I have a god bug. The bug of gods. Or the god of bods. Nope. Oh. I really expected it to be going into that one rather than this one. Looks like there's a second tree inside that tree. I kinda wanna go up there. Hello, bug friend. Goodbye. Surviving this body. Okay. 
kind of impressed that um, da, 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 slide to slide off. Hot. What? Yeah. Oh, you're a ram pig? What? Oh, yeah. While I can, I should uh, leave a warning. Me and James probably won't be doing many videos tomorrow because I will be at the uh, Armed Forces Day. Just to let you know. Thank you. Very well. Let me know. From half nine in the morning to five o'clock. Wait a minute, I just realized. Tigrex is a tier 3, but it's like the tools you make from it are tier 4. That's unbalanced. Black Toss is done. Hello. Like a pig to mud, except you can't swim in it. Kind of. Okay. Everything doesn't need to rhyme. Sometimes it just sounds dumb. Actually, yes. That sounds adorable. This 
Bob go to? Peculiar Den. Okay. Hmm. I'm curious what it is, though. Nursella. And then the nurse is dead. Perfect, because I've been farming these things for quite a while now. I am perfectly ready to kill a nurse If I must. And I make young monsters stronger than big monsters. Doesn't that mean a rider could just annihilate the hunter lifestyle, I guess? Because if they're expecting the big like, adults to be strong, and I make all the babies like four times as strong. I can just crush them. Not that I can do this. No, definitely not. Okay, maybe. Okay. Huh. Oh. I actually have to drop down off here. Okay. I called it. It's an Ursula. Let's ride and kick its spidery butt.
attacked you and you countered me. What the hell? That is not how I can't go work, but... Very cute. Can I kill it now? Why the hell? How is this Nursilla 5000 XP? The other one's 1200. Who came to help us? Or 2000, 1200 money. Whoa! You're super skilled! That's amazing, Roberto! You thought you were just gathering, so you let your guard down, huh? You don't get it, kid. The mushrooms in this forest grow alongside tracks that monsters use. Where there's a mushroom, there's a monster. That's what they say. To face monsters, you gotta first know the forest like the back of your hand. Is this really the same guy who was lounging around the house earlier? Ah! Ah! What's wrong? Uh, I touched a bug. Oh, so slimy. This may be the end of the road for me. I sympathize. Sort of. Not against bugs, but I hate slimy things. Huh. I guess he really is afraid of bugs. <laughs> All right. Dig in. Just try and stop me! <laughs> Taming and riding monsters, huh? That's some gnarly power you got there, kid. Our bonds with our monsties are all about kinship. We're at least 120% in sync. In sync, huh? Well, that totally reminds me of something my old teacher once said. Be the forest, become the beast. I was a total newbie. Man, I had zero clue what she was trying to tell me. First time I faced a monster, epic failure. I was just swinging my sword around like a dope. Then boom, I was flat on my face. I thought I'd lost. Like I totally thought that was the end for me. But then, I heard the whisper of the wind. The sound of water flowing. I was like, whoa. The wind was my breath. The water was my blood. I felt totally alive. When I came to, the monster had collapsed in front of me. And I had a vision. I was that monster. The monster was me. I guess you could say I felt in sync with it. I was a part of the forest itself, a creature, no different from a monster. Be the forest, become the beast. Those words finally made sense. Becoming one with the monsters is like a blessing, you know? Monsters give us hunters our livelihood. Can't have one without the other. Mm-hmm. So it got me thinking, maybe you and I aren't so different. So hunters are to riders what Devil Joe are to pickles? What? Maybe we can be buddies after all. Um, where? 
usually I'm the confusing one, but you've got me, buddy. I have no idea what you just said. Well, I don't know about all that. But I'm curious about this kinship with monster stuff. So I was hoping you could show everyone what it means to be a rider. Yeah! I thought you'd never ask, bro! We'll show everyone just how possum we are! Right, buddy? Show R to Pickles. What does that even mean? All right, let's head over to see the ladies at the guild. I can't see any similarities to from Devil Joe to Pickles. Maybe they like them, or how would you know? They're always okay. telling me about how lonely they get when I don't stop by. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty popular with the ladies, too. They love my super fluffy fur. Hey, buddy, let's go take a look at the quest board. There might be people who need help from a rider. No need for that. One such person is right here. Ah! Hello. It has been a while since we last met. I am glad to see you looking well. Ah! You came out of nowhere. Captain, you're always turning up like this. Whoa, she's here! Well, that is quite the greeting, Roberto. And to think, I am here to see you. Yeah? You two know each other? Yes. In fact, I have known him for quite some while now. When I first joined the Scriveners, he assisted with a monster habitat survey. Assisted? More like I was drafted. Well, Roberto, for the sake of our friendship, I have brought you a souvenir from the desert. Here. It is a conchu ornament. It is exceptionally well made. The craftsmen have captured every exquisite detail. Ah, a bug! A bug! Get it away! Don't come any closer! Oh, get it away from me! <laughs> oh, Roberto, how delightfully amusing. I see that you have not changed in the slightest. Ah, you must be Lilia's friend. She is well and working very hard in our employ. Awesome, eh, buddy? We're none too shabby ourselves, you know. So why are you here, Captain? I require your assistance. Roberto, it appears that you have not completed any meaningful quests of late. Too caught up in your mushroom fascination, it would seem. Explain yourself, Roberto. Can't hide anything from you, huh? <laughs> Lately, the Babda rainforest has been all weird. The trees and the river, they're weirdly quiet. There are fewer monsters, too. Something's off, man. I've been keeping my ear to the ground, checking it out. Well, Roberto, it would appear that you do have your uses after all. Well, uh, I uh, just go with it. You know, seeing is believing, or whatever. The oasis palms have wilted, the water has dried up, and the desert encroaches. What is more, monster numbers have fallen. I believe that all of this could be connected. The hunters have assembled and are forming parties in order to investigate the problem. Roberto, Ryder, I require your assistance. Sure is a paw is a paw. You can leave it to us. Yeah, we'll show you just how useful we can be. Greetings. So, kill it. Got it. Can be. Murder is my specialty.
that and chugging tea. But mainly the first one. against that pink raccoon. Wait a minute. What are the chances? Like, I am relatively strong, right? But I have a chance. I mean, I want more cheap little the moment it says, right? Right now. So if I level up, then I need more. Maybe?
I love it. Come on, Pinky. Time to die. This works at this baby. I'm gonna die anyway. Might as well go for it. I did it. <laughs> I did it. Oh, that is awesome. That is awesome. I just beat a pink Rathian. Something that is two tiers higher than me. And I used up everything I own. But I beat it. I did beat it. Sort of.
can I make out of it? Swords, armor, something. Nothing armor? Not hard armor. Damn it, Captain. Ooh. What? It's only first three. I have an adrenaline. I killed a tier 5 enemy. And you're only giving me... Oh, fuck it, that. I can take the core packer on this one. Yeah. talking about whoa buddy i think we got claws for concern it spotted us <laughs> Huh? Um. 
I have just read the report. You have my thanks for your assistance. It would appear that the situation was far more dire than I had imagined. If it was the Black Blight that caused the Oasis to dry up, we need to deal with it quickly, before the damage spreads. There's another oasis in the desert, the village of Albarax. There's a strange rumor making the rounds in that village. In the desert at night, the Black Fiend blots the moon from the sky. Black Fiend? It could have something to do with the Black Blight. I don't know nothing about no fiend, but I'm not letting the village get destroyed. What's up with the dude? Did he miss his catnap? I'm guessing it's where he's from. Albarax is Roberto's hometown. Yep. Yeah? Us hunters are heading out to see what's going on. You guys coming along? Does that mean you're letting us join your wicked possum band of hunters? Don't go getting ahead of yourself there, little dude. You still got some more work to do if you want to be recognized by us hunters. First, head to Oasum. A hunter's camp is being set up there. Once you get there, speak to Gentor. He leads the hunters in Oasum. Oh, yay. Our best buddy. And take care. Lilia would be beside herself if anything happened to you. Head to the mark on your map. I've got a few loose ends to tie up here. Let's meet up in Oasum. Well. I'm leaving this here. Hope you had fun. And bugger knows what's in the next area.